Well, I'm at Burgerville here in Hillsboro, and uh, this is a winter window. And I really like it. I like all the blue. I like the blue teal blend at the bottom, especially. Looks like they got some graffiti there. Anyway, has a really clean look, and it wraps this around. This is the BB Radio. Oh. <laughs> EV radio. <laughs> I guess they got their own radio station. Anyway, so I've got all this, and I've got a little on the other side too. And uh, this is going to be the last time I paint this store for I don't know how long. They have a new policy now where they're not going to be painting their windows. So all the stores are quitting. I find it to be kind of kind of silly because the customers like it. And uh, you take, take this, this window, window, for instance, I, I went around the whole store, I think I charged 300 for this. And this is up for three months. So that's 100 a month, 25 a week. That's less than, what's 7 into 25? That's uh, 7 days a week, 7 into 25 through 10 into 21. So, I don't know, it's, it's definitely, it's less than $5 a day. So, they would actually lose money by not painting the window. <laughs> Because you, you don't, don't think, think they, they make $4 a day off this? It's, it's, it's really crazy. But a lot of times they get new people in, new management, whatever, and they make decisions. They also decided not to decorate the insides anymore, too. Which, I don't know. I don't get it. And, uh, but uh, this store here, the Hillsboro store, has been really dedicated to me, and they've hung on the longest. So if and when they do start up again in a year, two years, three years, five years, whenever they decide, hey, we should start painting our windows again. Let's call Scott Campbell. I'll probably uh, come to this store first. Anyway, I thought I'd share that with you. And uh, just a quick video, but just a little FYI what I'm doing today. And I may go to another store, but I may just do this video. So, hey, thanks for hanging out. We'll see you later. Bye.